Hi, and welcome to Adventures with Grandpa on the Sarah Lynn. Well, we've been doing a few little improvements on the Sarah Lynn, and we'd like to take you on a guided tour of our little home on the water. So why don't you come along? The Sarah Lynn is a 1977 Ontario 32, built in Toronto, Ontario, Canada, and designed by CNC Yachts. She spent most of her life sailing the Great Lakes, but is now in Jacksonville, Florida. She is well maintained and ready to go as we speak. We set the uh, alcohol stove up here in the uh, galley and uh, we also have our portable fridge underneath it now so that makes the whole thing a little more space efficient. Uh, it's much easier to find alcohol when you're cruising than it is propane so um, this hopefully will prove out to be well a good decision. These Arrigo 3100s are a little bit tough to find, but we managed to get one on uh, eBay. There's a couple more out there, but uh, they're getting they're getting scarce. This is our V-Birth. So we insulated the bottom half. Top half is shelving. Plus, we added about uh, four inches of foam to the mattress to make it a little more comfortable. Yeah, we found that uh, burning wood inside the boat really wasn't such a good idea, so um, we sold the uh, wood stove to a gentleman with a tiny house. I think that'll serve him better than it does here on the boat. One of the projects that we did um, here on the Sarah Lynn was install a TV. That allows us to attend church on Sunday morning through e-church and then also to watch regular television. That just makes being at anchor or uh, in a marina just a little bit little nicer, a little pleasurable. The Sarah Lynn has a working radar, 
we installed a 3000 watt inverter and two new batteries. In the nav station we use our uh, Panasonic Toughbook. It has an AIS receiver and a GPS antenna. The Sarah Lynn also has an Axiom chart plotter on the binnacle as well as a standard VHF radio. Sarah Lynn comes with 350 watts of solar power and a 400 watt wind generator, coupled with a 3000 watt inverter, so she can run just about anything that you need. She's been well maintained and she's looking forward to her next adventure. Back home. 